Hey y'all, this is Randy, aka the Mobile Traveler. You know, you guys know I've been wrestling with the camper falling apart. Well, the back end's coming apart now. I'll show you that in a minute. But I want to talk about one thing today. There's a lot of people that are inquiring about this life and what they should get to travel in, so on and so forth. I'm gonna give you one suggestion. Make sure the rig is solid. Because if it isn't, then you're gonna go through the same problems I am. You're gonna have windows falling out, you're gonna have sides coming apart, metal coming apart, plumbing going bad, whatever, just make sure you have Make sure it's solid, or make sure you know how to fix it, or have somebody that does, because uh, anymore it's turning into a, every time I take a trip, something else is happening to this rig, and I love my truck camper, don't get me wrong, like I say, it was my son's, and I can't seem to get rid of it, uh, so I'm going to fix it again. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you over here what I'm rustling with now all right so I'm gonna turn you off and I'm gonna walk right over here and attempt to show you what I'm gonna do to fix it and show you the end game hey y'all Randy the mobile traveler love one another and subscribe okay as you can see that is the door frame uh, it is totally off down here you can see where it's kind of rusted through I think you all can see that down here you got part of the rig the floor was buckling it was falling down so what I did was I took my jack and I jacked up the floor to where it's level and I'm going to use these frames here I'm gonna bolt it to the closet and I'm gonna bolt it to the floor here and over here on this side I'm gonna do the same thing that's gonna keep the floor from falling now to get up in the rig I'm gonna show you what else we got happening here as soon as I get my fat took us up here in the closet you see that gap that's not supposed to be there so I am about two inches off side to side so that means I'm gonna have to pull the camper and twist it and I'm gonna have to put a frame underneath of it uh, I don't know exactly how I'm gonna do that yet I think I'll use some straps okay we're gonna come back out I gotta go out backwards that's a heck of a drop and don't mind the camper it's a construction zone right now what I'm gonna do up underneath here you can see it's kind of just coming apart it's terrible down here so I'm gonna add new wood from this side all the way over so I'll come back to you as soon as I get her done and show you the end game well, people, I'm going to try to get in the shown here. I uh, I got her done. Uh, basically, what I did was I put a Band-Aid on it. Uh, the door is flush. And as you can see, I got the braces down here. What I did was I, I had to use these little straps. And I put one on the corner here, one on the other corner. And I just had to pull her tight hold it and put her back together but as you can see the door shuts like it's supposed to so we're good to go no gappage we're safe but the moral of this story is like I said before try to get something that uh, 
doesn't need a lot of working. Well, I'll tell you what, Randy needs a shave. He's getting kind of scruffy today. But I guess that's what happens when you're doing a good, honest day's work. All right. Drive safe. Travel on, people. Don't forget to love one another if you can. And if you can't, you know what you do. You walk away. Thanks for joining me on this little video. Uh, getting ready to storm, so I suppose I better get picked up. Y'all have a good night. <laughs>